David, uh, thanks for taking the time. Um, it's been a strange start to the season for you, having got injured early on. Um, talking about your individual performance first, you must be pleased to have got back in the side. Yeah, obviously that's what I've been waiting for. Um, it was unlucky me getting injured in the first game or whatever, but I had to do what I need to do with the physios. It's a great physio team here to get me back on the pitch, and um, I'm just happy to um, get some minutes today. Obviously the results didn't go away, but it's something we need to look at, and now we need to just make things right. The supporters were really pleased to see your name in the starting side tonight. I think that's one of the, the things they were happiest about when we'd put the team out at the start of the game. That's got to give you some confidence as well to know that the town supporters are you know, so excited to see you play. Yeah, for sure. Obviously, that's one of the reasons why I came here because of the massive fan base and whatnot. And obviously, they can expect me to give 100% every single game I play. That's just how I am. Um, but now it's about me helping the team in any way I can to um, get the results in. It was a really energetic performance for you, encouraging, I think, for, for you individually. Um, a lot of tackles, a lot of energy up and around the pitch. You, there's one point in the second half late on where you, you carried the ball from your own edge of your own box into the edge of the opposition's. Is that what we can expect from you across the course of the season? Yeah, for sure. Um, out of position, I'm going to give a lot of energy to the team. I'm going to try win the ball back for us and I'm going to try and run with it in, um, in possession. That's something I'm, um, I pride myself on and... Uh, there's a lot more to come for me. I still need to improve a lot of bits, but with the coaching staff here and things like that, I think there's a lot more to come. Obviously, it's, it's difficult for you coming back into a side that's struggling at the minute with results. Um, how was that for you? Was it better for you to almost be on the pitch and feel like you can make a difference rather than being sat on the sidelines? Obviously, as a player, you want your team to win all the games. So, obviously, um, watching, when I'm watching the games, I'm obviously wishing that we can get the results or whatever, but obviously we haven't had the best results. So obviously me coming in, my goal was just to get into the team and now make an impact in what way I can help give energy in the middle of the pitch and drive the team up and bring a lot of um, intensity. Um, obviously we're unlucky with the result today. I thought we were the better side. Um, the attitude is there from each and every one of the boys. So um, it's just about now analysing the game and seeing what went wrong and hopefully we can make it right Saturday. You know, dis despite the result, the, like you say, the attitude seems to be there. We, we did get back into the game in the second half after the penalty. What's the, the mood like in the dressing room? Obviously, the lads are gutted, and so we should be, because if you look at the stats, we're the better side. If you watch the game, we're the better side, we've got the better chances. Um, but we come into the change room losing with zero points, so obviously there's a lot of disappointment from the boys, because we need to turn these games into wins. So... Um, it's literally now we can't keep our heads down for too long because that's the beauty of football as a game and well, this week. So we need to recover, look at look at the game back and see what we can take from this game and go into Saturday and make, we just need to make sure we do a job Saturday. David, congrats on the first start and uh, we'll go again Saturday. Yeah, cheers, mate. Thanks. Head it up.